Cribber, thanks for joining us again. A tough loss on Friday night under lights against Hawthorne, but you must have been more pleased with the defensive actions in particular. Some, some of the tackling and the, the hard spreading defensively was great. Oh, yeah, look, the intensity and effort, uh, you know, for three quarters was, was where you'd expect it to be. It certainly wasn't above expectation it's AFL footy and, that, and, that, and that's the you know the minimum standard we need unfortunately we couldn't sustain it for four quarters. One of those situations again where we lose a player through injury and are forced to activate the sub perhaps earlier than was anticipated how much does that change what you do in terms of in the box? Oh, look, I think it was in the third quarter wasn't it? Is that when it, yeah. when it was? So yeah look it probably didn't have much impact because we would have um, brought Phillips on some stage through the third quarter so on this occasion it didn't really have an impact for us at all. What's the next step from here in terms of continuing to improve and, and develop the players and their, their responsibilities on field? Yeah, look, we'll just continue down the path that we have been. And, you know, again, the, the, the game against uh, Adelaide and now the game against Hawthorne in, in terms of the, the, the competitiveness and the, the intensity that's required, uh, we've been able to bring that for two games. And, you know, that, that's, that comes down to attitude. So we'll continue to work hard with the players in terms of how they prepare themselves mentally for the game. And, the mindset that they come to play with. Um, so, you know, we've, we've got a pretty young group um, that we'll continue to work with and educate. Um, you know, we've got guys that are coming in and, in and out of the side at, at the moment with, with, with different injuries and form a little bit. So, you know, we'd like to settle the team down at some point. But, um, yeah, look, we're certainly still working uh, with a long-term view. Obviously, when Flipper came on, it was as a result of that injury to David Roden. How serious is it? Do you know at this stage? Or no, I'm not sure. No, no, we won't know till um, probably no more tomorrow. And um, yeah, once the docs have a look in, but um, yeah, not not sure at this stage. Next week is up against the Swans at the SCG. Quite a small ground playing against a side that really plays great contested footy. Do you look to do anything differently on the track this week in the lead up to that game? Oh, look, you know, like, like it'll be the same every week in terms of how we prepare. We, you know, we focus a lot on, on us and, and how we want to play, but also obviously look what the opposition do and what their strengths and weaknesses are, and we'll, we'll plan for that as, as it is a normal week. Great. Thanks for your time today, Cripper. No worries.